So you stumbled across a video on fiber. Now before you just click off because you probably think this is gonna be boring, I'm gonna make this worth your while because I'm gonna teach you why fiber can actually make you leaner, but you just gotta make sure you watch this whole video because I gotta explain the boring parts first. All right, I promise fiber is actually not that boring, but stay till the end and you'll find out why exactly fiber is going to make you leaner. So what's up everyone? It's Anthony from AB Fitness Center. So there are basically two types of fiber that you need to know about. So you have soluble fiber and insoluble fiber. So soluble fiber slows down the digestion of your food. It attracts water into your gut and kind of makes like a gel and it makes the digestion process a lot slower okay which also has been shown to decrease um, heart disease and lower blood sugar so and we've all heard about fiber that you need to have fiber but fiber is very very important for overall health the next type of fiber that we have is insoluble fiber insoluble fiber adds bulk to your poop okay and uh, it also helps you to it's kind of like the um the rotor rooter, whatever that's called, uh, helps to push everything out of your stomach and intestines, and you know, it adds to that to poop. So ultimately, it helps things kind of slide out and cleans. It's actually pretty cool because, <laughs> well, it actually helps to clean everything out. So as it as you know, the poop travels through, right? You have some stuff that gets stuck on the lining, and the fiber kind of pushes it through, so it, it cleans out. Essentially, I don't know how many more other ways to say that. <laughs> so one of the biggest myths around fiber is that fiber doesn't have to be counted. I only have to worry about the net carbs. That is BS. The BS meter is going off like crazy. That is nonsense. Fiber still has calories, okay? So fiber still needs, you still have to count it. It still counts. So just worry about your total carbohydrates for the day or total carb servings for the day and not, okay, this food has net, I think Quest bars are really bad at this. It says like it has like net like 10 carbs in it, but it's really bull. Look at the label. If it has 21 grams of carbs and it says 10 of them are from fiber, you still got to count that 21. So don't fall for that myth and mistake like most people do. That's why you're watching this video. And that's also what's going to help you keep you leaner as a little added bonus because now you know to count those carbohydrates into your total for the day. So the other thing, okay, if fiber is going to be so, so beneficial. It's going to make me leaner. It's going to keep me healthier. I'm just going to overdo fiber and I'm going to, I'm going to have so much of it. And I've actually been down that road before. Too much fiber is very bad. Like I said, it pulls water into your digestive system. It causes gel in your digestive system. So what that means is you're gonna be bloated, you're gonna be gassy, and you're just not gonna feel right. Your stomach is gonna really, really hurt. I've had a lot of people who, they try to eat healthy, right? So they have a lot of like brown rice, quinoa, a lot of fiber-rich foods because it's healthy, not lose any weight, and complain about being bloated. So as soon as I cut back their fiber intake, all that's gone. And that's just a simple fact of the matter. Too much fiber is no good either, okay? So, and like I mentioned earlier, fiber is very, very important for overall health because again, like I said, it keeps you cleaner <laughs> and helps the things to move along. So, the moment you've been waiting for, how fiber is gonna keep you leaner. If you're interested in learning more about how you can get actually into better shape, just click that link in the description below. But let's get rolling on why fiber will keep you leaner. So first one, it will keep you fuller longer. That is key, that's the key right there. By keeping you fuller longer, you're gonna be less likely to go to the cabinet and grab things out of the cabinet. So that's the key. Whenever you're dieting, and whenever you're trying to lose body fat, you wanna try to keep as much volume in your stomach as possible. So fiber is really, really good for that. Second thing, it will help you stay healthier. Again, lower heart disease, um, better poops, <laughs> lower blood sugar level, which obviously keeps you alive longer. You can't be dead and lean. I don't know what happens to your body as far as, well, I think your metabolism just kind of stops. I would assume when you die, it's just kind of, that's it. But if you're dead from being unhealthy, you can't get leaner. So that's, <laughs> that's another one. But again, the main key with fiber is that it's gonna keep you full of longer. So it's definitely a tool. So Anthony, how much fiber do I need to have? As a general rule, for every thousand calories that you consume, you want to make sure you have anywhere between 10 and 15 grams of fiber per thousand calories. 
So if you have 2000 calories, you wanna have anywhere between 20 and 30 grams of fiber a day. All right, so remember, hopefully you taught, you learned some stuff about fiber. Thank you for staying with me during this boring topic. I know most people like fiber, I don't, I don't need to worry about it, but it's very, very important. It will keep you leaner longer. But remember, don't just watch my videos and do nothing. Go out there, take action, have some fiber today, and I'll catch you on the next one.